Hello, welcome back to my channel. I'm very excited. Today marks nine days until my event, my 30th birthday event. I feel like I never took the time to stop and be like, girlfriend, congratulate yourself, celebrate yourself. I never did any of that. And that's so important as you're growing and you're on a journey of self-development. I feel like I just get so obsessed with that that I just, I'm like, okay, how can I be better? How can I be better? How can I be better? It's like, girl, ugh, look what you did. So I'm really excited to pause and celebrate myself as I step into my 30s. And we're gonna do a, a soiree extravaganza event. And the best part about it is that my mom and one of my sisters are coming to town to celebrate. They're actually going to be here in LA. We have nine days, nine days to get everything together. I started doing this at the beginning of the month when I came back from Christmas. Since the theme is accepting my flowers, I just want it to be a cute vibe in there. Everybody feels homey, comfortable. I made a mood board for my cake. I made a mood board for the flowers because I want to have real flowers as decoration on the table. And I made like an overall mood board for decorations. I was making a final list on my whiteboard that was from the garage. Y'all, let me update you. I finished all this stuff from the garage, took it out, and I sold the equipment. I unfortunately didn't get to take all this stuff up off the floor, but I tried my best and it wasn't working, so. I actually don't think I showed you guys. So this is one of the mirrors from my, the garage. I haven't cleaned it off yet, but I low-key like having a mirror in my closet. I'm gonna get like something to frame it and like spray paint it gold or something. Don't look at all this mess. We're gonna organize this. Remember, we have to get our station. I have to get all my products and stuff in a little setup station. This is just storage stuff, like blankets, bags, easels. So I can find a system to make this stuff work. And then over here, my shoes are doing so great. First, I wanna say I ordered these plates and they were cute, broken when I ordered. That's why you need to order things in advance because they're not always gonna come intact. I also only got 50 plates. I'm like, I'm not gonna have like 100 people there. Like there's 25 in this, and then it has 25 small plates. So I'm like, I feel like 50 plates is fine. But then I'm like, what if people need more plates? But I'm like, you're not gonna just get a plate and then throw it in the trash. We're having a taco bar. So in this box, unfortunately, I can't take anything out of here because it's sealed. We'll take these out on the day of, because I had to take it out to check to see if anything was broken. But these are the glass vases that I'm gonna put the flowers in. I was wondering how they were gonna send them without breaking, but they did a great job. Um, I ordered this acrylic thing to hold desserts. Look how small it is. I should have known when it said six bucks. Oh, I have these little lights to wrap around trees. I have curtain string lights that I wanna use. I may get another one of these but I don't wanna get one for no reason um, because they're 20 bucks. I also wanna make sure I stay like low stress for this because I'm not about to have any breakouts. And it's my time of the month this week and I'm glad I'm getting it out of the way before my birthday, but we already had a little situation happen there and I was like, don't. I didn't even tell it what time my birthday was because you're not about to pop up. Alrighty, we're here. Whoa! These birds, these stupid pigeons just attacked my cat. No, they didn't. They're probably getting some crumbs or some food down there. There's like a whole gang of them. Watch. Look at them. And they keep coming. What is going on? And I have to go over there. Somebody else just, they just walked through the pigeons and they flew away. So hopefully they stay away. my birthday coming up and I'm doing like a little like picture wall and I'm putting like fake flowers on there and I want to kind of like drop some essential oil so it can kind of smell like flowers yes, yes. so I don't know what they're gonna don't need too much just yeah just a little bit mm. Mm. this one smells I think this one <laughs> smells the best to me okay I have to come back here anyways okay. I just wanted to smell them but if I think I can come back and get the rose if anything yeah and just get like a small little Thing. Perfect, thank you. Yo, so I'm back in my room. Actually, I still have to eat. I haven't eaten yet. I just hate recording anything in my room when it, it's dark because it looks completely different. And the sun is set in. Look at where the sun is, like right there. You can't see it. 
you can't look into the light. But it's like 30 minutes in the air right now. So I think I'm gonna just go stuff my face because I still wanna do these flowers, but I never got my other package. I'm about to check up on that because what's going on? I ordered some roses that were supposed to be here yesterday. Hello. Can you got the deluxe? It has like onions on there. Mm -hmm. And jalapeno, yeah. <laughs> And Billy classic sandwich. Yep. Look at Billy's feet. <laughs> <laughs> hey, what's up? Oh, that was a little spicy. What's going on? Eight days. Eight days to my birthday. Wait, eight days till the soiree. We're calling it a soiree. Yesterday, after I ate, I was like, okay, time to go set up the flower wall. I was like, where are the roses? They were supposed to be delivered yesterday, two days ago. They delivered it to an Amazon locker. I was like, I've never even used one of those. Is that something you sign up for? Is that something that the, if nobody's at the door to pick it up, you have to go and put it in the locker? I don't know how that works, but it's not the most convenient thing for me. <sighs> not me nervous to see this. This company had really good reviews, so I'm excited. guys i love these ones didn't know they were gonna be this dire for me this is gonna be cute af so i got it from this company it's called ling's moment on amazon it's like this store ling's moment is the name of the store cute 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 so i'm not necessarily worried about this being white and these being kind of like the same colors I didn't know this was going to be so pink, honestly, now that I'm really looking at it. Like these are what kind of what I was seeing, but I'm not mad at that. If these don't go well on the grass wall with these colors, then I'll just hang these as decorations around the building. So I've been fluctuating between what the heck am I doing? Why am I throwing myself a party? Because what? And then girl, accept your flowers, celebrate yourself, you deserve this. So I decided, instead of even telling yourself, oh, I'm nervous, oh my gosh, what's going on? We're not even gonna say this stuff. I'm not talking about like this right here. The moment I start feeling these thoughts, switching it right over to this side. Because I honestly, like, I'm not, I don't have time for that this year. Move, I'm not taking that into 30. No. What am I talking about? I'm starving. I'm about to go eat, and then I'll show you guys when I do the grass wall and then see you at the mall, so. Okay, this is definitely smaller than I thought it was. Yeah, this is cute. good day it's literally the gloomiest day this girl has house slippers on outside in the rain a maniac but whatever her life anyways it's super gloomy today it took me so long to leave the house and i'm also like procrastinating because i'm like oh my gosh what if there's nothing there but then i'm like i'll never know if i don't go i'll know once i walk in what kind of vibes we on but yeah i'm here at the house of cb they have a location here and I think that's where everybody's going. Yeah. I'm not necessarily looking for anything that's like, this has to be the perfect birthday dress. No, I just want something that is a cute color, is fits me well, it's comfortable and it like stands out. And it's, so I'm thinking like classy, sexy, sensual type dress, you know? Here we go. I'm so nervous. Um, 
is this lingerie? What the heck? Okay, got these bamboo cocktail pins for the fruit. Those are cute. And then look at these cutesy forks. I'm gonna be like, everybody you get one fork. Don't go throwing it away. Cause I'm not about to spend a bajillion dollars on forks. These are very ivory. I don't know how I feel about these. I'm gonna have to save these and I may have to get, go to the store, Party City or something. I got one of these DIY lash kits. We'll see. And then I think these are the candlesticks. Oh. Yo, I had zero luck looking for a dress today. Not one piece of luck. Cute. They're very gold. It's very gold. I want it to kind of be more like not this gold. But the other one was way too expensive. I'm like, it's not that deep. Also, I was thinking, I'm like, usually I plan an event and then I chill in the in the in the corner. I can't do that at my own birthday. Oh, I feel like I have a performance. We have like five days till my soiree, guys. Five. So this is like the real countdown. Ugh, I'm freaking out. Here's the deal. Today I'm getting my brows done and I'm sitting here trying to hype myself up because I absolutely hate this more than anything. But then we're gonna go try and find another dress. I honestly, I have really, I feel good about where I'm going. I think it's gonna be good. I think I can get everything there and I'm really feeling that today. Last night, I freaking made all of my product, both Lavendula and the Shea, and I made the body oil, and I labeled everything and like cleaned everything off. That right there like was so much stress on me. And the fact that I just like stuck it out, I watched a show called Anatomy of a Scandal. It's insane. Oh gosh, nobody better ever cheat on me. Ow. Oh, I'm still in the car, I'm still in the car, I'm still in the car because I'm scared. Just do this, we're not scared. Ow! <sighs> oh my goodness, y'all look. See, clean up. Even though Loki, I feel like she should have gotten these, but I'm not mad because that hurts so bad. So I'll just dermaplane that. I'm obsessed. Okay, I'm glad I got over that hump because that right there stresses me the heck out. That was like the thing keeping me from being excited for my birthday is like, you have to get your eyebrows done. Um, we're about to head to the mall and find my outfit because it's gonna happen. <sighs> Good morning. So yesterday was literally what I would like to call a false positive. Why? It's because I went to the store and I was trying on dresses and I'm like, I went to the store I usually go to, Lilliful. You guys have gone there with me. And I say usually because it's more of a boutique. So I feel like it's not like going to Zara and I feel like they have like more options for dresses for me to actually try on. When I went, I had like four or five dresses that were kind of around the same kind of feel. Tried them all on and I was so desperate. There was one where I was like, okay, this is kind of cute. And everybody around me was trying to be supportive. was like, yeah, that's so cute hate it. I don't like it. I showed everybody I showed it to was like, yeah, that's, that's nice dress. I'm like, that's not birthday dress excitement. When my mom, when I showed my mom and she was like, wow, not excited. I was like, yeah, no, I hate it. Getting a different dress. And she was like, yeah, I think you should too. What? Um, I have to get the sticky stuff out of the garage. And I hired somebody to come do it. And I really hope that they are just able to get it up. I just hope my issue was that I didn't have the tools and the proper stuff to do it so he can get it up. Today um, is another attempt at trying to figure out what I'm wearing. So I am going to go to Santee Alley. We've been there before. We just weren't going for dresses. So this is where around where I go to get the oils and all the stuff from the store. Y'all remember there? That's where we're going. It's just like right around in that district. So it's like the fashion district and there's so many dresses for like so many different occasions, but they're really like costumey for me. So I'm hoping I'm able to like dig through and find something that speaks to me for the rest of the day. I'm taking this out and I have to just wash and blow dry my hair because we're doing our hair tomorrow. There's so many dresses there. I'm literally going somewhere with hundreds 
and thousands of dresses. There has to be one for me. So God, I pray that my dress is just sitting there waiting on me, perfect size, perfect everything. And I just get to get it and put it in my closet and get excited to wear it on my birthday. So good news. Good freaking news. How cute my eyebrows are now. The tape in the back. So I went back there to check and tell the guy that I was about to head out and he's got all this stuff up. I thought it was gonna be so impossible for him to do and I was so anxious. I'm like, what if he has to go and get his, his acid treatment? What if he has to do all this stuff? If you need power washing or anything, great customer service. They take care of you. They're very efficient, urgency, understanding and they get the job done. So that really just like, uh, I don't have to stress. I can get the property manager off my back and be done with that back unit. One million push, one million. No pictures. Oh, no pictures? No I'm pictures. Sorry. I found my dress. Let me tell you. So I had every intention to show you guys everything that was going on, but they're kind of weird about recording in these stores, in certain stores. So I was just like, you know what? I'll just tell them about it. I couldn't even film myself in any of the dresses because they didn't have any mirrors. It was a pretty focused mission. And I feel way more ready. I feel way more like it's my birthday in this dress. And I think it goes way better on the background. I can't believe I was going to wear that other green one. <gasps> so embarrassing with those hideous earrings. Okay, so the next time you guys see me, I'm gonna be picking these, seeing them up from the airport with new hair. Hopefully they recognize me. They're gonna be like, who's that babe picking us up? It's me.